What's going on guys? Beastly Gamer here. Welcome back to the channel. Thank you guys for joining me. Today I want to talk to you about the latest Nintendo NX leaks. Now, there's been a lot of information that's come out and I just got my hands on it. It is super, super exciting. The information is actually coming from a, a Nintendo partner and actually a well-known retailer. Somebody's been leaking information. They've seen posters. They've seen packaging for the game. They've seen specs for the Nintendo NX and they've also received pricing details and I wanted to get you guys the information so I could hear what you guys think about it and if it's exciting to you because for me it does seem kind of exciting I'll drop a link in the description major Nintendo NX retail partner leaks NX price bundle features specs and more a new Nintendo NX rumor has surfaced which claimed that the console might offer gaming in 1080p at 60 frames per second while 4k streaming would be possible as well Furthermore, the rumor suggests that the NX will release with at least four launch titles. The console's base price tag and bundle prices have also been mentioned. Nintendo's new console remains a mystery, and the console is yet to be detailed. In a recent interview, Nintendo insider Emily Rogers discussed some NX rumors with YouTube personality Super Metal Dave 64, in which both talked about the console's architecture. According to a new leak on the Nintendo subreddit, Details have been leaked from a large Nintendo retail partner. The source is said to have been verified as the leaked information comes from an individual that should have access to the information leaked. One of the most interesting tidbits of the leak relates to the marketing of the NX console. The interaction with games on the go appears to be a very important advertisement phrase for the NX. The rumor claims that there will be at least four launch titles, one of them possibly being a Mario related title. Demonstration units will be received by retailers in February, and it is believed that the NX will have a bundle option that will sell for $399. The base price point for the console sits around $299. We've included a full list of leaked Nintendo NX details, and I'm gonna go through that for you now. Okay, so this is all the verification information. We have verified that our source works for a large retailer. We have verified that this source is in a position to have access to this sort of information. Exact details of what was provided will not be released. We take protecting the identity of our sources very seriously. Our source has added the disclaimer that this is initial information and subject to change as time goes on. As part of our responsible leaking policies, we will be rewriting the information we have been provided in our own words in the off chance that specific verbiage could help track down the source's identity. I've asked our source to monitor this post to make sure that the content that we've rewritten on their behalf is still accurate. There may be some small edits or corrections as a result. So here we go. Nintendo's NX marketing. All right, so here we go with the marketing. Number one, interact with your game on the go, end quote. This phrase is seen on the poster. Number two, strong co-branding effort with Mario launch title on many posters. Number three, console is currently set to launch with at least four titles on deck. Number four, stores should be receiving demo units around February. And number five, the base price point will be sitting at $299. Now for the Nintendo NX bundle. Number one, the NX is currently set to have a bundle option. Number two, the contents of the bundle are currently unknown. Number three, the bundle price is currently sitting at $399. So I would suppose that that's maybe another controller and a game. That might be, you know, worth $399. Based on the leak, the packaging for Nintendo's new console still mentions the NX codename, although there is no indication whether this is merely a placeholder name for the console or its final name. The NX is said to be packaged in white and blue coloring, a color scheme that the original Wii used as well. Now here we go with the Nintendo NX packaging. The packaging of the NX will be slightly larger than the Wii U's packaging. Number two, the packaging is relatively clean and simple and is similar to the Wii U's in terms of package design. Number three, the color scheme of the packaging is white and blue compared to the Wii U's blue and black. Number four, the packaging still says, quote, NX, end quote. However, there is still no indication if this is a placeholder or final name. And number five, the areas of the package that would usually depict the hardware were blurred and redacted by Nintendo in an attempt to keep them hidden. So they still don't want people to see what this thing looks like. Wow. All right, so just like recent rumors, the leak implies that NX will use cartridges and 4K streaming should be possible on the console. This does not apply to games, and those will likely render at 1080p 60 frames per second. So, the Nintendo NX key features. Games will be on cartridge. 
Number two, 4K streaming has been mentioned. What this likely means is playback of such content as Netflix, etc., not gameplay. And number three, 1080p 60 frames are being used as the marketing terms in relation to gameplay on the console portion. I've heard unconfirmed rumblings of 900p for the infamous hybrid part of the device. So this is really, really deep information. Uh, and of course, at this point, you have to take this with a grain of salt because nothing has really been revealed concrete. But if this source is to be believed, this is a pretty intriguing piece of hardware. 900p on the portable aspect, 1080p 60 on the home docking station, which means once you dock it, of course, it gets a little bit more power from that station. Uh, 4K streaming, that's actually really cool. Uh, I can't believe it, but only four, uh, apparently, at least four launch titles. But that does sound very Nintendo. For you guys who don't know, Nintendo, for many, many years, when a new console comes out, they only have a handful of games. I remember the 64 and the Super Nintendo, they'll have like five or six games total to launch with it. And that's just kind of the way it used to be. So apparently Nintendo is still sticking with that. Uh, the box is about the same size as the Wii U's box. And of course, they're still redacting the image of the actual console. I'm super excited about this thing. I want to know how you guys feel about it. Does any of this information uh, get you guys pumped for the revelation of what this NX could be? If they're planning on these demo units getting out there in February, that's only a month for people to actually play it. When are they going to show it to us? To me, in my mind, it has to be any day now. they got to show us what this thing looks like. they got to show us what it can do and get people excited about the future of Nintendo. I'm already excited. There's a lot of money to be spent over these next few months between PlayStation VR, PlayStation Pro, uh, the Nintendo NX, and then coming next year, the Scorpion. It's really, really a tough time if you want to buy everything. But this information is really exciting to me, and I can't wait to hear what you guys have to say about it. Let me know in the comments below. Be sure to give a thumbs up, show support for the channel, follow me on Facebook and Twitter, and tell all your friends about me. I'm the Beastly Gamer, and I'll see you guys next time.